So take me through post high school. Okay, so like, was there Gardner Webb? There was Lafayette. Like, what was? All right, so. How, how, how did that go? So, uh, late eleventh grade, early twelfth grade, I decided that I was gonna commit to uh, Gardner Webb, and then I played, you know, the course of my season, and I realized like, not to knock Gardner Webb, but I'm just. I mean, I, my talent can be taken to a higher level. Uh, so, and also I was still 17. Um, so I was one of the youngest people in my class. And I decided like, well, I should, I should reclass because I've seen how much, you know, physically my body has changed in just one year um, from 11th grade to 12th grade. So I was like, okay, I'm gonna reclass and go to Hargrave. So I went to Hargrave so I can get out, cause that was the only way I could get out of the a scholarship with Garner Webb too, because I had signed. Uh, okay. And so, you can only go to prep school. yeah, okay. I couldn't like back out and resign with a different college. And that was a Garner Webb. Yeah. Okay. Right. And so, uh, I went to Hargrave for a little bit, and uh, it, it wasn't, it didn't work out the way I planned. So I left there, and then I was back home for a couple months, and then um, I ended up going to Louisiana Lafayette for the spring semester. And then after that, um, I didn't like my situation there. Didn't, I just didn't cope with some of the coaches and stuff. And so I decided I'm gonna leave. And then the only route from there would have been going to JUCO because I didn't display any, you know, I didn't play in any games at Lafayette, nothing like that. So it's not like a, another college is gonna pull me. And so I went to a JUCO in Pensacola for a year and then I came here. So, this has been like the longest by far. Right. Like, so, <laughs> does it feel like this place has been, like you've been here for like 10 years because of that? Because other places were so kind of short, like. Compared to the other schools, yeah. of course, it feels like, it feels like this is, like if you ask me about my college career, most of my stories are gonna come from here. Right. Cause I've been here for three years. But uh, some people say their college career is like, Man, it flew by and so stuff. I honestly don't feel like my college career flew by because I've been to three different schools and had to build new relationships with different people here and there, learn the area, all that kind of stuff. So, um, it's I mean, it still it still is kind of crazy that's coming to an end. But at the same time, I mean, I've had a I've had a good long journey. How many, so how many different coaches have you had post? Including Hargrave, yeah. four. Okay. So, when you go through all those different places, like, how tough is that? I mean, that's mm. got to be tough. Like, you're learning different. Talk about like learn different things, learn different areas, stuff like mm. that. How long did it take you to to get comfortable here? After all those. Uh, I think I think the coaches and you know the players that you know when I came here, there was more players that were from around the state. You know what I'm saying? PJ Sin. Um, J Mac, you know what I'm saying? So they were already comfortable with the area, which allowed them to to help like welcome me into the area. Um, so it didn't take very long for me to get comfortable here. Um, and they were, you know, they were a strong nucleus of the team. So um, I think that helped out a lot. But I've always moved around my whole life to different places. Um, so it's something I got accustomed to. Yeah, because of your mom yeah. and her. So where all has she been? Uh, she's been to, she's been to Korea, Germany, Italy, Washington. Uh, she's from Jersey. Um, she used to live in North Carolina. Oh, she's been everywhere. So how long, where did you go with like, were you, I know you've been to Italy, like where all have you been? Because of Overseas? Yeah, yeah. Overseas wise, I've been in Italy and Germany. Okay. Well, I mean, I've been to different countries, but I, I actually when, lived in Italy. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Is your mom going to be there tomorrow? Yes. Okay. Of course. Okay. Yes, sir.